Portfolio views provide the user with a wide variety of data display options, including bubble charts, histograms, pie charts, scorecards, side-by-side -side histogram, and stacked histogram. Watch as we demonstrate how to create portfolio views. On the Portfolio tab drop-down, select Manage Portfolio Views. Right-click and select Open in a new tab. In the Portfolio Views page, select Create View. In the Create View pop-up, expand the new Portfolio View tree. Select New Pie Chart and note the other options. Select OK to create the view. Click in the title box and type a name for the new view. Select the data drop-down list. Scroll to find the data value to use. In this case we selected actual total cost. Select the group by drop-down list. Scroll to find the value to use for grouping data. In this case the value prescient strategic priority is used. In the select user access to this view section, set all users. Select the Show Group Label checkbox. Save the view. Return to the Portfolio page. Refresh the page by clicking Portfolios. In the top screen, click the View drop-down. Scroll to locate the newly created pie chart. Select the new view. The data is presented in pie chart format using pastel colours and the legend also is displayed. Return to the Portfolio View tab. Select Create View. In the Create View pop-up, expand the new Portfolio View tree. Select New Scorecard. Select OK to create the new view. Type a name for the view. Select Data Columns to include in the scorecard. Actual Total Cost is selected. Move the value to the Selected Columns pane. Click on unwanted columns in the selected pane. Remove the unwanted column. Scroll to locate other required columns. Select plan total cost. Move the value to the selected pane. Select plan labour cost. Move the value to the selected columns pane. Select planned non-labour cost. Move the value to the Selected Columns pane. Reduce the Cost category. Expand the Project Codes category. Select a code, in this case Prescience Group Owner. Move the value to the Selected pane. Select Prescience Oz Region. Move the value to the Selected pane. Close the Project Codes category. Expand the General category. Select Project ID. Move the value to the selected pane. Move the Project ID to the first position in the selected columns list. Scroll down the page. In the Select User Access to this View section, set all users. In the Select the Fields to Group by, click on the Level 1 drop-down. Scroll down to select a field. Select a field in this case, Prescience Win Probability. Select Save. Return to the Portfolio page. Click on Portfolios to refresh the page. Click on the View drop-down. Scroll to locate the new scorecard. Select the view Prescience Win. The scorecard displays. You can export the scorecard to Excel. Click the Excel icon. Click OK in the Opening Export Data pop-up. Expand the Excel columns. Review the data in Excel and then return to the Portfolio page in P6. In this demonstration we have shown that Portfolio views are easily created. Views are made available to a single user, all users or another user. Portfolio Views provide excellent options for delivering project data to stakeholders, 
Portfolios also provide stakeholders with opportunities for governance and oversight, both strategically and operationally. Thanks for watching this Learning Byte. Don't forget to check out the others in our collection or visit training.prescience.com.au for more options to gain great real-world skills in Oracle Primavera.